Right everyone, Web Collector here. Right, I thought I would do a video on the issue that people are having recently with importing knives and swords, legal knives and swords, from the US and Canada. So recently this was covered by Matt Easton, Skoda Gladiatoria, and he seemed to think it was more our end, but from the experience I've seen, I don't think that's the case. So what this video is for is to see if we can get this sorted by you lot contributing to this video and it can then be passed on or you'll send an email, which I'll explain in a minute. So basically, as I said, what's happening is people are ordering legal knives from America or Canada and those knives are being sent back to the sender. But the issue that I've seen isn't UK based basically. What it is, the seller, say from America, pays the postage to the UK. He sends the package, it goes to his country's postal service and at that point they refuse to send it and send it back to the sender and charge the person again to send it back to them. That's not a UK issue. As far as I'm aware, this may be going on quite a lot, but it's not massively known. What I'd like you to do is let us know and Blade Magazine know what the issue is. If enough people can give Blade Magazine enough information and proof of what's happening, they may be able to do a magazine article to cover this and maybe stop it because these things are not illegal that's the main issue of this is people are trying to import perfectly legal knives they're legal in America they're legal to import export to and from the UK as well and these postal services are stopping it and charging people money when none of that should be happening it's not illegal to send those knives to this country, it's not illegal to receive them in this country. There's no postal, there should not be any postal issues with these items. This has been covered by larger channels, but from the experience I've seen, I think it's US and Canada based. It's more their side rather than our side. So yeah, can you help? If this has happened to you, There'll be an email below. You can you can talk to me in the comments if you want, but what we really want you to do is email Blade Magazine and send them details of what happened to you and any proof you've got. So hopefully you've got some pictures of the, the postage or a letter, something like that, saying that these items are illegal. In the description to this video as well will be the email. So yeah. Hopefully you can help and hopefully we can sort this out and then we can start getting our knives and swords back into the country that are perfectly legal to import here in the first place. Right? Hope you enjoyed the video. As I say, I hope you can help. See you later.